Time now for our Making a Difference report, and tonight's story is about making some dreams come true for children whose wishes can be incredibly modest because they don't have permanent homes and families. Even the smallest things can become a very big deal in life. Cue some caring and generous grown-ups stepping in and making a difference. Their story tonight from NBC's Ann Thompson. Right, here we go. This is the sound of a wish coming true. Music lessons, accessible to many children, are what 12-year-old Khalil always wanted. But they're elusive when you're in foster care. And music is like a passageway, and it's a way that you can just let everything out. On this day, Khalil gets a lesson and a violin. My legs are shaking. <laughs> made possible by one simple wish. So far, these are just the Christmas ones. Founded by Danielle Glito, One Simple Wish seeks to give foster kids, often moved from place to place, a sense of normalcy. I really wanted to find a way to let more people support them and show them that there's lots of love and lots of hope out there. Danielle and her husband Joe were foster parents and adopted Mia, a big sister to Lily. This New Jersey charity asks a smaller commitment matching donors to a website full of wishes big and small. Some are very basic, deodorant, crayons, or suitcases, to carry their things from place to place. You may not be the person who could keep the child out of the group home by taking them into your home, but you can be the one that makes sure that they get their graduation photos like everyone else in their class. Victoria and Nakaya wanted to go to Camden's Adventure Aquarium. They fed stingrays and sea turtles, finger painted with penguins, <laughs> and even walked like one. How much did Nakaya enjoy her day? This big. Other thank yous for the more than 3,000 wishes granted are in letters on the office bulletin board. What do these do for you? This is, um, these are our reasons. Yet there is one wish Danielle can't grant. I'd like to give every one of these kids a forever family. A lot of these kids have no idea what it's like for someone to love them unconditionally. What she can do could change Khalil's life, giving him and many others a chance to hit the right notes. Ann Thompson, NBC News, Trenton, New Jersey.